This is the final filler for National Treasures. This is filler D. And um, we have our previous filler winners right here. You can see all those names right there. Uh, those are from previous fillers. Now we have this filler, the final filler here before we are breaking. And we have 10 other names. So those owner's names go right here. Let's start up the race. You want to be in the top four to get spots in the break. So we're going to shuffle these up pretty good here. Seven times, as a matter of fact. One, two, three, four, five. Five, six, lucky number seven. So we have 10 runners that are going to run this race. And the top four will get in for $11 to National Treasures. So I hope you uh, feel lucky right now. Here we go. On your mark. Get set. Go. Good luck getting your spot in NT for really cheap. Oh my gosh, Keith is out to a big lead with 49 seconds left. A lot of race left, but Keith has also got the his other Keith is going up in the front. So both Keith, uh, but Keith's got some strong runners in this thing. 30 seconds left. It's a halfway point. Mike Wise has been up front for a minute. He's still up front. He's got two names up front. Mark's feeling pretty good. Keith is feeling pretty good. But look at the bottom track. 18 seconds left. Michael Wise got two out front. Oh, my. Right now with 10 seconds left, Michael Wise is out front by a good margin. And um, we are looking at a big lead change right here at the end. Oh, my gosh. Keith right here at the end comes up out of out of the back of the pack and takes first place we know keith got first but let's have a look and you can see everyone here listed keith got two spots and steven uh congratulations uh to steven keith and michael uh, way to go you guys won in the filler so you got spots into national treasures who that concludes the filler part of the break. That was filler D. So I'm just going to put our final names right here at the bottom of this list. Um, yeah. Right there. And so boom, boom, boom. Keith, Stephen, Keith's other racer, and Michael. Good luck, everybody. Let's start the random see who gets which teams in the break and we're going to start off by randoming the owner names first then we're going to random the teams and we're going to stack the lists up side by side so we're going to randomize each list seven times a piece and they go side by side if they finish randoming All right, here's the lucky number seven. Good luck. That's the first list finished randomizing. Now it's time for the next list to go through. Oh, my. National Treasures is happening. Seven times. Lucky number 
seven. Now you can see your team in the break. Michael White, you got the Atlanta Braves. Tim, the Pirates. Good luck with Hayes. Dave S. got the Blue Jays. And so there's all kinds of good teams on here. There's Tim with the Yankees. Craig with the Red Sox. There's just a lot of great teams to own. You could be a, getting a Dylan Carlson in here. Let's go ahead and get this in alphabetical order by team name. And let's get to the rip here in NT Baseball. Open Sesame. Oh, looks like we have an Austin Riley for the very first hit. Very nice. Atlanta Braves, Austin Riley. Ho. Very nice. There you go, Michael Y. with your Atlanta Braves. They hit with the first one out of here. Next up is a Colossal Jonathan India rookie card. Oh, look at that patch. That thing was so nice. Cincinnati, Timothy K. has got a nice hit there. That is number 99. That's 90 of 99, Timothy K. What else is popping out of here? There's a nice Colossal. We are looking at that a second ago. Jonathan India. And what else do we have coming up? It's a George Brett. Oh, Game Gear. Bat Relic type hit. Congratulations to the Royals owner. Kansas City, Joe S. pulling down a nice George Brett. I don't see any pine tar on that bat. He was a beast. He was an absolute beast. Look at the Boba Shet. Oh, really cool looking patch, too. You can see the different color blues. 32 of 99, Boba Shet for Toronto. Dave, nice one for you, my man. Wow. Here's a Blake Schnell autograph. Padres. Big old thick stock on this one here. This on-card auto is coming out to Tim Timothy K. Who? Nice Blake Schnell Padres. Look at this one. <coughs> oh, this looks really nice. Interesting looking signature. Midnight signatures. This this is like a really well made thick gloss type of card here. It's thick stock. And it's also got that very, very high gloss. So really nice number to 99 for the Red Sox under midnight signatures hit for Craig. Oh, 
Nice rookie. Midnight signatures. That's it. Coming out of here. Look at this patch in auto. Oh my gosh. Ryan Weathers. Padres rookie. Padres have been a good team to own in the break. And that is Timothy K with this awesome patch. Nasty hit. Nasty. Nasty, nasty. 23 of 25. Weathers rookie. Mm -mm. Oh, my. Oh, nice. Yankees hit for Tim M. On card auto, Torres. There you go. That's a really nice Torres. Four of 99. National Treasures. The final hit in the box break. The final hit. Wishing everyone the best of luck. Because this is a book type of hit. What is it going to be? Signature material cut. Signature material of Max Carey. One of ten Pirates. Pittsburgh Pirates. Tim M. has got a book. Auto of a legend of baseball. Max Carey. I don't really know a lot about Max Carey, but I do know this looks like an old, old, uh, older player from back in the day. So a Max Carey hit for Tim in the break. Number to 10. Congratulations. Oh my gosh. Max Carey was uh, a switch hitter. Born in 1890. Played for Pittsburgh most of his whole career from 1910 until 1925. And then he played for a few other teams. But my goodness, what a legend of baseball you have hit in this break. Very interesting story behind this player, Max Carey. You can see some of his other pictures, too, as he was in baseball for a very long time. 20-year career. And, uh, man, that's epic. That was an epic hit, bro. Congratulations. Yeah, that was amazing, the hit right there. And a uh, Hall of Famer. For, he was in the 1925 World Series. And, um, man, there's just there's a lot of information I know you can pull up about him. That was just on Baseball Reference, but you can see Wikipedia, you know, all about him. The Brooklyn Robins from 26 to 29, the Brooklyn Dodgers. He was also a manager at some point. Uh, you can see some of his big stats here. As a player, he played for 20 years. As a manager, he coached for, for a year. Stolen base leader, 10 times stolen base leader. Inducted in 61. So, yeah, really cool hit, man. That is awesome. And it's National Treasures Baseball. That's good stuff, man. That is always a great break.